Hey everyone, it's Amy, and I've got a Walmart haul, and I couldn't resist. Yeah, it's not even Halloween, but they're starting to put out the Christmas stuff. I mean, they were working hard putting that stuff out. Oh my God. Just, please let it start raining money so I can buy all the beautiful Christmas stuff at Walmart. This year, they have gone above and beyond. They have so many wood signs that are rustic looking. Oh. So pretty. I only bought one thing today because it's not even Halloween and we love Halloween. Not as much as Christmas, but but I bought this lighted stag head. As you can see it was five bucks. Has 43 mini bulbs, suction cup included, no assembly required, indoor outdoor use. They had a nativity star, a snowman, a penguin, I think, and they had, or they already had some empty spots, so I don't know if they'd put all of the different designs out, and they'd already sold out of some of them, but I wasn't waiting around on this. I love deer, so I had to have it, especially at five bucks. I mean, come on. Oh, and they have some, oh gosh, I don't know why I haven't bought any or why I didn't buy any. They have metal stakes that go in your yard and they have their gold, like an antique, like black rub on gold. They had snowflakes, Santa. They had the truck with the Christmas tree in the back. What else did they have, babe? I can't remember what else, but they were 98 cents each. Dollar Tree better be stepping up their game if they're going to keep up with Walmart this year. Anyway. So much pretty stuff. Can't wait to go back next week see what else they've got. <sighs> My store, you know, kind of really sucked when it came to Halloween stuff. There just wasn't that much of it this year. The other store we go to had a bigger selection, but nothing was like, oh my God, we have to have that. Unlike Michael's that has... Oh, so much pretty stuff. <laughs> but, yeah, I can already tell Christmas is going to be awesome at Walmart. Alright, great value, quick oats. We bought these for our super worms, right? Yeah, we have super worms that we feed our bearded dragons. And you gotta keep them in, like, oatmeal or Cheerios or something. Alright, I picked up the Midnight Drug-Free Sleep Aid with melatonin and herbs. Now, remember, I used to get the Nature Garden Sleep Aid from Dollar Tree. I swore by it. I still swear by it, but it's not on the website. It's not... In, I've checked three stores. They don't have it anymore. I'm guessing they just stopped selling it, and Dollar Tree was the only person that sold it. They're a person. Company. There were third-party sellers selling it on Amazon and eBay, but they were just buying it at the Dollar Tree, I'm guessing, and selling it on those sites. Midnight is, I'm guessing, what is the name brand, because it has the same ingredients, lemon balm, chamomile, lavender, and melatonin. Yeah, this stuff works so well. I had been taking just plain melatonin because I couldn't find the nature garden and I tried looking online for other stuff and everything that was natural was just Benadryl overpriced Benadryl at that so Tony started looking for me online and found the midnight brand yeah it's higher it's like you get 30 in here for 750 and you only got eight for a dollar at the Dollar Tree so it's like twice the price but I will pay it all day long. This is the best thing I've ever taken for sleep. And it's even the same cherry flavor that dissolves on your tongue. <coughs> Donuts. Inamons. I like all of them, but I really like the plain ones. I don't know why, what it is about them, but I love that. Got some plums. Real bacon pieces. Mm. 
Nature's Own Butter Bread. Oh yeah, I forgot to tell you how much this stuff was. Um, bacon bits like a dollar thirty-three. Inamins donuts, I think it's like three fifty-four, three eighty-four. Plums were dollar eighty-nine a pound. Oatmeal, how much was oatmeal? Two forty-nine. Two forty-nine, something like that. Bread was two sixty-eight. Got five pounds of potatoes. They were were they two sixty-seven, something like that. I don't know. Might have been cheaper to have got 10 pounds, but we don't use that many potatoes around the house. I mean, we'll use them. I mean, <laughs> we don't eat that, cook and eat that many potatoes. So it's better for us just to get a five pound bag. Today, I was looking at an old recipe book, one of those little booklets that uh, Campbell's used to put out, and I came across this recipe for like creamy paprika chicken or something like that. It's got spices and flour. You mix flour, coat the chicken, cook it in butter, add the cream of chicken soup, and then. Um, at the end, you add some sour cream. It sounded really good, so I picked up some chicken. It was $1.98 a pound. It's just their no-name brand. So I got 4.4 pounds for $8.76. By the way, that little booklet had like a whole crap load of coupons. And they had no expiration date. <laughs> I'm thinking, why does nobody use these coupons? hand harvested and hand selected new world farms super healthy great in cereal healthy snacks start into yogurt smoothies over ice cream excellent source of vitamin c and antioxidants promotes eye health anti-aging helps against memory loss it's 1.25 pounds and this was it's on clearance for two fifty. It was three ninety seven originally. Got some cool whip. Got a thing of sour cream. Yeah, this is the three pound container, and they had like a seven pound container there, and it's like, wow, that's. A <laughs> I can't, I just, I have no idea why would you would need seven pounds of sour cream. <laughs> but anyway, um, I need this for two recipes. I'm going to make some dip as well. So I know we'll eat it. We love sour cream. More clearance signs were these Edwards. Lemon meringue pie, you get two slices in there. It's two fifty, so we picked up two of those for Tony's lunch. And we picked up two of the turtle pies. And then we picked up, I don't know where the other one is right off, but two of the chicken pot pies for dinner one night. Got some Mayfield Neapolitan ice cream, which was oh the pot pies. I have no idea how much they were. I think they were like a dollar seventy eight. The ice cream was seven dollars and twelve cents, and it's four point five quarts. Got some jugs of water. Not gonna show that. That's boring. Green onions. 
the other pot pie. This one's another clearance find. It's the Cherry Almond Gorgonzola Top Salad Kit. It was originally... Well, it's 206 and it says save a thirty seven. So I'm too tired to do math. I had blood work done today. My brain isn't working. <laughs> it's got green cabbage, romaine lettuce, kale, red cabbage, carrots, green onion, dried cherries, garlic croutons, and almonds with creamy gorgonzola dressing. I'm gonna put some chicken over this. Yum. Picked up a pumpkin pie and I decided to try the Great Value brand. It says no artificial preservative, no high fructose corn syrup. This was only two ninety eight. Oh, this is an eight counter breakfast sandwiches. I thought this was only four. This is the croissant ham and cheese. These are really good for breakfast. dozen eggs. I don't know how much they were. But dozen eggs. Tommy's lunch. He got the beef pot roast. Um, fettuccine with chicken and broccoli. These were on sale for $2.08. And the roast turkey breast and stuffing. Roast turkey breast and stuff is only 290 calories. That's fantastic. It's got 1,110 milligrams of sodium, though. 20 grams of protein. Grab two of the rising plus pepperoni pizzas, because they are 287. And these are big pizzas. These are... One pound, 10.6 ounces. And they are good. I mean, good, good. Because I don't like very many frozen pizzas. These are one of the very few that I like. Got some Simply Fruit Punch. And some Dan and Vanilla Yogurt. And that's it. Oh another little haul that'll be a collective haul. Went to another Dollar Tree. Found some good stuff. Well, I found one thing at Goodwill. But I really like it, so. And then, oh mama, did we hit the jackpot at the Salvation Army thrift store. Yeah. We found... A gorgeous solid wood bed frame that retails for $800 for $99. Yeah, and it is gorgeous. Oh my god. We made it home with the footboard and the slats, and Tony goes, it's gonna go with these mom tomorrow and pick up the headboard and the um, wood the wood siding pieces. So, yeah. Oh, I have the dream of turning our bedroom into like a hotel. Like, you you walk into it and you just immediately just feel amazing. So, and to me, it's all about picking pieces one piece at a time rather than just going and buying. Like, when you go to like rooms to go and you're just like, I'll take everything. To me, that's just, that's not me. I want to pick out each piece, choose the pieces that we love. And this bed frame is so impressive that Tony saw the footboard because they just put they had just put this out. If we hadn't have seen it then, it would have been gone. Because there was like people gathered around while we were um, asking if we could pick it up the next day, and we agreed to pay for it. And this other woman's like, well, "That's a really nice bed." <laughs> 
she would have got it. I'm about to guarantee if we hadn't. But, yeah. The footboard was so impressive that Tony thought it was the headboard. Because they just put it out and it was out there by itself. And it's, um... Yeah. It's heavy. It took two guys just to carry out the footboard. So... I can't wait to get home. It needs to be, um, you know, cleaned up. It's got some dust on it. But, yeah, we didn't go out with plans to buy a new bed today. But, yeah. You never know what you're going to find, so you need to have your eyes open. So, yeah. I can't wait to show it to y'all. It's so, so pretty. <sighs> It's gonna look so good. Can't wait to find some um, side tables, you know, not tables, bedside tables, whatever you wanna call them. Yeah, I told him that I would, yeah. Water, Tony was putting it up and he wanted to see if I wanted to show it. Yeah, we get distilled water for our CPAPs and spring water for like making um like tea or cooking and we don't feed our dogs we don't give our dogs tap water and we don't drink tap water unless it's been filtered because we have city water oh yeah we got small little dollar tree haul the thing from goodwill bed frame from salvation army and I picked up some cereal from Walgreens. Because they had honey bunches of oats. And that's my jam. Especially with almonds. Oh, so I am tired. Tony had a doctor's appointment at 720. I had to be at the rheumatologist at 945. Which was in another town. So, we've been going since we left the house before 7 this morning. Oh. oh, can you put this stuff in the fridge? Oh, yeah. He wants me to shut up. Okay. <laughs> Be sure to like, comment, share, subscribe. Hit that bell so you never miss a video. Okay, he didn't want me to shut up. He just... He's like, do I turn you off? Do I go in there? <laughs> that turned me off, baby. We'll see you next time. <laughs>